Hello, my name is Tin and today I make this Osmo extension rod. Actually it's monopod with a few add-ons so Osmo handle and camera can be attached on it. All I need is these few parts to get something like this from a monopod and Osmo. Someday I bought the cheapest possible monopod to mount Osmo handle on one side of it and with extension cable connect Osmo camera on another side. But how if monopod don't get treated on needed places? After a bit of thinking I got an idea, so let's go to work. First I make the camera holder. For that part I take a piece of aluminium and settling it all around to get nice finish. Then make a groove in a shape like last monopod leg. I could make it nicer, but this part is not seen when it's mounted, so don't talk around about it and nobody will know for that. The part got really sharp patch, so cut it before the blood runs out. I also make 2M for treating it, but I was still impressed by overthinking and forget the recording. Anyway, look like the part fit for monopod. But there comes another problem, monopod leg is too big and I don't want to cut them away. So I must to bend that camera holder part twice to avoid lag. It still don't fit, there's a plastic edge, who needs space, so let's make this free space. Ok, this part fit now, and this screw also helps to hold it on its place, so the holder can slip up and down on monopod leg. Since I got this holder table I can make radius, so make one of that holder also. Much better. Now I make a hole and treat on the end. I don't got one quarter UNF treat cutter, so just use M6 which is a bit different, but there is just a few turns so the screw can fall out. And make two extra M6 treats on holder, you'll never know when you use it. Now I need this screw to mount camera holder on monopod and ball head onto. First make two grid screws for mounting the holder on monopod. I make it out of aluminium and glue it into stainless screw later. Make a bit of shape, drill hole and cut the treat, that's it. I got now this two knob for mounting the holder, but still need one screw to mount the ball head. M6 screw can fit into ball head, even if it's the same dimension as one quarter UNF treat. That's because M6 got one millimeter pitch and one quarter UNF got about one twenty-five millimeter pitch. So set the lathe and make one. When I got finished treat, cut it on needed length and that's it. Now make one more big knob for that screw, so we can mount ball head without any tool. And this is the result, I added two glue on the screw so the glue holds stronger on its place into knob. This is what I got so far. In base this is everything I need, so prepare it for anodizing. All small parts mounted on aluminium rods, where I connect positive wire later, but this is the last chance to finish the parts before anodizing. I already said that I make another video about anodizing, but just a few steps anyway. Some kind of aluminium become black after bathing in H2SO4, but it disappears in a second in other solution. When I got anodized parts, I add distilled water into container and add some cake color. After a bit of boiling, I got some really nice result. Black color got a bit of red pigment, but that red knobs is just awesome. And now I can glue screws into its strongest tree lock, which hold it on its place rock solid. When it's glued, leave them overnight, then cut it away and fix the end of treat. I think I got everything complete now, as called, ready for mounting. Main screw installed into holder and it can fall off. Now easy mount ball head or any other holder with one quarter treat. Now take monopod clamp and screw the holder in it, without using any tool. After normal tightening, things look surprisingly solid, and even looks good. 
Now I mount Osmo extension cable and Osmo handle with magic arm on monopod. After that I was left without phone holder. Let's say that I want to have them somewhere there. That's mean that I need another treat. I don't want to make another holder so disassemble the monopod and make M6 treat. I make treat through the leg, so holder can be mounted on left or right side. But there remain scratches, so I make thin plastic washer that the tooth still grip on Osmo handle but don't touch and scratch the surface. We can assemble all together, need a few minutes to assemble it out of case. Ok, this is how final result look like. Because of the phone holder monopod can be close up as possible. The minimum length is about 70 cm. When we extend monopod the camera is about 150 cm from handle. And it's not too heavy to carry around even with one hand. Because of the ball head on the end we can set Osmo in normal or flashlight mode. After a bit of testing around I realized that I must do something with that cable. Monopod already got some glue into clips, which will be perfect for small cable clip, so draw and print them. With these clips cable is on its place now every time. But I print two more add-on for that holder, this and this. I rid of magic arm and Osmo handle attached with that clip, which is stronger and handle can mount closer to camera, so monopod can be extended to maximum 170 cm. So that printed part can now screw on monopod treat and got function of leg. Other part is front leg, so the camera is protected from the floor. And no, I didn't know before why I use this XRM6 treat. Osmo handling camera is protected now, so we can put it anywhere on the floor for a few grams more. This part got one more function. It's big help that you can rest monopod on your body, while hold it with one arm and with other control Osmo handle. Total length now is about 170cm, but with the body support it's not too heavy to carry around. Ok, let's try to make some shots now. That's it, I'm really happy with the result, but this clip was from really first test, so I must learn a bit how to work with. It's great for low and high shots, you can lift camera about 4 meter high and make low shots without flexing your back. All clips I shot without z-axis, but there is none seen that much walk effect I think. Another great thing there is that I can put all together except the monopod into Osmo case. So thanks for watching, like, share and subscribe if you like and see you next time.